Jesus, mm. the rule out and all that. We're having mm. the discussions and yes. we're talking about our own shatter and mm. all that. But basically, these are the people. We're looking at Davido, Stone Boy, mm. and then uh, Shatter. Mm. They are the people now. They've just got something. Sack. And I'm saying with Chim. Oh, on Chim. On Chim. On Chim. But just say, we want to. We want to draw with some of these things. And even uh, mm. uh, Morgan Heritage also, okay. also drop one, okay. which they are also around, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's uh, now, the listening. Yeah. My, our, our, our major uh, concern is huh. how do these people put these strategies together and what yeah. comes in mind? What is their motive mm. to be able to make sure that, okay, this thing, we, we are targeting these people, want to push it this mm. angle to get to the people. And that is why some of them will do the press releases, some will do the interviews and all that. But some other ones have kept quiet about it and people are complaining. Mm. So, you see, um, first of all, let me congratulate those who are doing very well. Mm. And let me also encourage others who we think are not, are not pushing are not pushing <laughs> i i don't want to use i i am using encourage because um somebody who goes to alpha beta mm-hmm. and some dhs and somebody who also goes to fabo the other thing of dhs unfortunately these two people have different resources mm. but Another unfortunate part is that they they will be writing the it's same, same as Yeah. And if said your wife for bit an etra, that your wife for body ever to mature kun etra. I I think it is so unfair for you to use the alpha beta case mm. as a weapon to insult the one. Someone was just saying it's it's the right thing to do because they are all dealing with the same uh, syllables and the same of uh, course. Books and all but the one in Alpha Beta has a computer lab and a science lab. Mm. But the other one don't. The have. one in Fabodia Better Network, what's the most crowd do you say you crap? Mm. You have no computer or board, so man. So then people sometimes we you need to and the only thing you can do is encourage, encourage them. them. Now let's come to the matter on board mm-hmm. that has to do with these artists yeah. releasing albums and how they promote it. I think we will congratulate the video. Okay. If I congratulate the video, it is on the fact that there's one thing during this whole promo of the video's timeless album and its comeback. One thing that caught my attention really and to me is on point and artist. On Jazzy's statements that he came to make that mm-hmm. has people or have people seen how the video how the video is promo out there promoting his album? They did not wake up to say, "Oh, oh I'm the video. I am the video. I am OBU, <laughs> yeah. thirty So go yeah, and so go, yeah. so. mm-hmm. In fact, any post, any effort, any speech that you hear the video say in recent times. All is connected to yeah. the promotion of the album, and it is beautiful. Yeah. Aside the funding that is going through it, which is also very paramount, mm. the effort in there is very beautiful. Mm. Now, when you come to Stone Boy, yeah, I think Stone Boy is also doing very well. Mm-hmm. I know Stone Boy is doing lots of sacrifices to make sure this album serves the purpose in which he wants it to serve. Okay. Yes, there are so many inconveniences that Stoneboy is going mm-hmm. through just to make sure this particular album is doing well. So I think all the same, and I would also commend Shatter and Sack. On the other hand, yes, we don't see this as high as that of the video and Stoneboy. Mm-hmm. But then, it is because these two sets of people don't have the same resources. Okay. But then there is one thing that all of them are doing. There is one thing that is constant. Which is? Which is all of them are trying hard not to be complacent, one, mm-hmm. not to be self-entitled, mm-hmm. and are all putting in effort, effort 
to make sure they promote this album. Okay. You see what the video is doing. Mm -hmm. The video comes on. You see any video of the video, and it's about timeless. Mm -hmm. You see now. Tell me which of Stone Boys post on social media is not connected to the third dimension album. Definitely it does. They are doing everything they can to make sure Charlie. Mm -hmm. They push it. Yes, they know. Oh, I am Stone Boy. I am Sakodi, I am the I have fans. I can just come and throw it out to them. And, it. and it will still do something. Mm -hmm. But these people are putting putting in effort. Sakodi is about to go on tour okay. with this album. Up in Europe or something. Of course. Yeah. He's about to go on tour with this album. Yeah. Now, Shaka, ever since he released this album, let's check which particular time Shaka has come on live or has even posted something that is not connected to the album. And this particular dance hall album, eh, as much as I know people, some people have their own expectations as to, okay, the album should go and talk. Number one chart. It okay. should go and talk one one chart. It should go and do this. It should go and do that. Case okay, here. The truth of the matter is, if you watch it very well, you will know this is an exper uh, experimental album. Mm -hmm. Sack is doing everything by himself. Okay. He doesn't have any external entity supporting him. Stoneboy, on the other hand, mm -hmm. has Dev Jam. Yeah. Shaka is doing everything by himself. So. Doesn't have any external entity supporting. So, that is how far their strength can carry. The people which we are seeing, the Stoneboys and the videos and all that. Chale! <laughs> Money being pumped. It's not for anything. The money self that is making this. Ah! Barcelona and Girona are playing, and on the advert rollout on the pitch, Spotify is advertising timeless. You think it is a joke? <laughs> or you think it is because it is the video? Yeah. No! It has been paid, paid for. for yeah. It has been paid for. So if we want to say, oh, our people are not doing. Mm -hmm. uh, they are not pushing their albums. Their albums are not talking charts. Mm -hmm. Their albums are not doing this. Also, go and bring the videos two million dollars that he spent on his album that he think he did not go anywhere. <laughs> bring it. Give it to Shatawale or give it to Sakode. Mm -hmm. And if they misuse the money, mm -hmm. then you can come okay. and hold their neck. Until then, let them do what they can. Let them do what they can. That is how far their strength can carry them. Mm. That is how far their strength can carry them. Okay. You can't you can't compare, let's not compare apples to oranges. Mm. And say, oh, because they are all fruits, they all give us vitamins. <laughs> like relax. <laughs> okay, so somebody also argue that looking at the caliber of uh, Shatter and mm. his pedigree and all that, is he supposed to be having an experimental album at this point? Of course. Of course. You see, this is a, how do we call it? A person that is so, quote and unquote, mm -hmm. not a normal artist. Mm. There is somebody that in the year has released more songs than any other artist. Mm -hmm. Even in the first quarter, mm -hmm. has released more songs than any other artist. Yes, you can bring the argument of, oh, and I did not hit, and I did not do this, and I did not do that. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, what is the musician's job? Is to create, okay. feed the fans, and make money. This guy is never complaining that upon all the songs that he's releasing, he's not making money. So if you, there's always different ways to arrive yeah. at the same okay. result. Yeah. Also, you go few walk from here to Kaswa. <laughs> Somebody to go pick car from here to Kaswa. Mm -hmm. Everybody read Kaswa. Yeah. So yes, you might have certain view of okay. 
this is Shatawale. He shouldn't be doing this. He shouldn't be doing that. Actually, <laughs> everybody would wish that Kidi had not gone on break. Mm -hmm. But Ben Asheni with the man. He's on break. <laughs> no, Ben Asheni with the man. Oh, whoa. <laughs> so, at times, eh, yes, people will have, oh, Shatter and his caliber, Shatter and his this, yeah. Shatter and his that. Ask yourself, will your perce how will your perception <laughs> be beneficial to mm -hmm. whatever he's trying to grow? And me, I am even happy he put out this album. You know why? Because throwing singles here and there, here and there, here and there, yes, even though they are all part of mm. releasing, I believe that having a body of work also puts certain premium on you. Mm. One person that we always boast of to have, to have the most album in this country is the legendary Amri. And it is a record. Yeah. Bro, now, if Shatter says, okay, every quarter I'm releasing one album, so I during the whole of last year release how many songs? It is just one album. Okay. Stone Boys for the past three years has not released any album. Mm. Last year, he released how many songs? I think two songs or three songs. Shatter in the last, in the first quarter has released more than 20 songs. So if this person wants to put all of them in a body of work, mm -hmm. and you see Stoneboy's uh, third dimension, the last time he held an album listening here in Ghana, he said the 17 tracks were taken from 65 songs. Mm -hmm. 65. Mm -hmm. He had to pick 17 she from 65. Yeah. So just imagine the collection these guys have yeah. under their sleeve is cassette. Until you have you, you less until we, your friends say, oh, any solution to pump money into it that come let's do business. <laughs> it's as simple as that. You think Shatter is not promoting uh, uh, Mali album? Bring two million dollars mm -hmm. and see something. Is it okay? So uh, the the somebody like uh, NYB as we, we were talking about also okay. said made a uh, a statement that there's no even clear um, strategy with your promotion mm. on concerning Shatter, mm. and is basically probably he thinks you guys lack management, like the management skills and rules. The he thinks there is no. He thinks there is no. Plan. Even to the extent that he said you, the media people, even mm. there. Though, yes, you, Sami, and co professional, you do your job, mm -hmm. but he's not even getting that feel of your impact as media people with Shatter. So he thinks there is no plan. That's, that's the perception. So the thing is that, Sir with all the planning and everything that he did for Jam's album, not to sound disrespectful, but which of the media guys? If not Sarkozy to come and say something, it's having a conversation about Jams album making. Because maybe the camp is also not pushing to the media. But you people are there, you guys are media people when you are there. So at least we expect something the, from you the, people. The, the truth push. of the matter is anything that has to do with the Jams album has been, uh, sorry, the Mali album, album has been put out. Mm -hmm. Anything, anything that has to do with the Mali album. Mm has been put out and you see he thinks there is no plan <laughs> but actually the plan is working really oh yes the plan is working he thinks there is no plan but the plan is working he's not seeing any like you guys don't even put anything out there concerning this the plan is working you see let's ask us i i said that this is more of experimental for an artist of Shatter's caliber to, let's see, assuming he did not see, he's not doing anything about Mali album, just throws in the album mm -hmm. without any noise, mm -hmm. without any interaction, without any interview mm -hmm. about the Mali album. Yeah. Let's see how far that album album can climb. Oh. It is a, that it is that is one of the strategies. Mm -hmm. Okay. So put the album in there mm -hmm. without boosting, 
without any more promotion any and interviews and intensive and promotion and, and interviews. Put it there. So that is what you people plan. Exactly. Let's let's see where the album will get to. Okay. And that will be you, your strength of you. It is like you putting um how do you call it? A thought is there. See how far you can go. it can go. Then now you can calculate, okay. What because out of this particular Mali album mm. and it released, really mm-hmm. it has attracted so many investors. Okay. Now, if you should see the height at which the Mali album has got into, that will give you an insight or more insight or more leverage when Chata is about to release the next album. And he's planning on releasing an Afrobeat album next. Oh, okay. Yes. He's planning on releasing an Afrobeat album next. <laughs> so now, you think Mali album has no strategy. The strategy is actually in motion. It is working. Is it that he just want to test his strength without maybe, as you said, with the promotion and everything? Of course. He just want to test and see that, okay, if I don't push, if I don't do interviews, let me see how my fans, how of course. the people can accept. See, some, people, some people, people of his, his mates, like some of his peers, mm. are complaining. They are always self entitled. And they release no more. Mm. And they release no more. Now the people don't mind us again. Mm. Because now they drop songs and they don't get that media bass. Mm. Brine, 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 like that. Mm-hmm. Okay, so assuming Shatter says I am handing my microphone, but then all the songs in my collection, I want to release them. Okay. I'll be releasing them like this. Whereby I'm not going to put in that intensive promotion and all that. Okay. Isn't this particular thing evident that Shata can now relax mm-hmm. and still be releasing songs and eat and still be competitive? It is it is very evident. Okay. Because even when we thought, oh, he's not doing any promotion, there's still a conversation about the album. <laughs> of course. All right. That's what I'm saying. You may think that, oh, there is no strategy. But that is like, the strategy with you, guys, Musa. you guys have. The strategy is with Jatumusa. And see what happens. Exactly. <laughs> All right.